Yeah. Really, truly happy for you. Also, your words make me feel very sad. <laughs> mm. Yeah. And with that. Yes, with that with that somber <laughs> that note. Stirring introduction. <laughs> Miss Clue. Well, welcome to the Press 80 Gaze. I'm Mal. My pronouns are they them. I'm Fiona, my pronouns are they. Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's it's a double they today. They they. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And we're we're playing something that I am just so very fucking excited for yeah. because it's another one of these garbage <laughs> fucking piles <laughs> that I had so much fun with last time. Oh, this so is uh, Miss Clue colon Trials in Salem colon the mystery of the purple diamond. Ah. It'll it'll turn you purple. Uh, yeah, let's let's do it. Great. Let's go. I will full disclosure. I'm not very good at these types of games oh shit okay so this is gonna be great right fiona's driving right now i am uh i may i may jesus take the wheel style <laughs> take the wheel at some point if it's necessary. tag team i can tag melon oh hell yeah to. um oh, there we so go. let's do it jane i'm so glad you've come down we were just talking about a distant aunt of yours hello everyone oh it's fully How voice acted mm-hmm. holy crap aunt Catherine. Actually, not all that distant. She was the daughter of Edward Darcy and Caroline Villiers. I believe we still have a portrait of them somewhere in the attic. That sounds intriguing. Oh, is that an action? Yeah, we've got to click that it. That sounds intriguing. Okay. Uh huh. More than intriguing. More Edward than more than intriguing. More than intriguing. Who shares your name with him on a business trip to New England in 1692? It does Did she actually the say anything? Men often different. make the most unusual decisions. Darcy men. Where mm. about New England did business take them? He was going to Boston, and it involved setting up some shipping arrangements. Look at that I.e. smuggling. Fire. Fire. Adventurous. <laughs> did they get caught up in the Indian uprisings which the French were provoking at the time? Oh, no. Nothing so prosaic. It could have turned out to be a rather uneventful business trip if Edward had not agreed to let his daughter Jane go with her friend Beth here, the granddaughter of Thomas Danforth, to visit the Bradburys in Salem. Wasn't done for Actually, the lips moving and everything is uh-huh. very... Colony. Yeah, uh, look, at, look at the fucking... The, our, the moves. It's, it's so good. Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna throw down. Stoughton was selected as lieutenant governor. Both were colonists, and it turned out to be a very poor, poor choice. choice. I don't recall the Bradbury. Thomas Bradbury was a nephew and. Oh my gosh, we're getting like this like I know. history lesson right now, yeah, and it's like it's fucking ridiculous because you're probably gonna have to know some of this in order to like. Oh do dear. Yes, this will be a game where we will be fucking trolling through the message <laughs> boards on the Miss Clue uh, website to figure out how the wow. fuck to play it. This does sound fascinating. What happened to make the trip so what fascinating? What happened? This is something that you will find of particular interest, Jane, as the stories surrounding 1692 are only preserved by the... It was a shameful time. Them. Why would that Why be? Why would that be? <laughs> because once the madness of the, the madness of had passed, there was a concerted effort oh, to geez. destroy all the official documents surrounding what happened. What, what caused, caused the madness? The madness? <laughs> A number of things, but one of the strangest mushrooms in the well. Oh shit! Uh oh. According to Mr. Upham, a in America, it was believed that Where the subtitles go? had been seen by men's bodily eyes in a town neighboring Salem. <gasps> oh, it's a ghost! They glided over the fields, hovered around the house, <laughs> and reappeared on the And no ocean. socks, because apparently when you die, you keep your like fancy ass clothes, but you don't get socks. I mean, their movements were observed oh. by many of the inhabitants, and the whole population of the Cape oh. was kept in a state of Oh my god. Look at this Ken doll motherfucker. I was gonna say, it looks like a 1600s version of Superman. Oh jeez. ...in a state of defense against the diabolical besiegers. Sixty men were dispatched from Ipswich in military array to reinforce the garrison. They sent 60 guys with guns to go deal with the ghost. Uh Uh-huh. That's some... Much powder was expended, but no corporeal or incorporeal blood was shed. 
Additionally, the sounds like a good excuse to get a vacation. God. No, I'm gonna get my gun. We're gonna go hunt a ghost. That all rational persons will be satisfied that Gloucester was not alarmed last fall for above a fortnight together by real French and Indians. But the devil and his agents were the cause of all the molestation which at this time befell the town. It was uh, all a quite oh, dreadful. Oh my I gosh! Come yeah. on, Aunt Catherine. Oh, so it was I, that I in clicked. the midst of this terror in 1692 that many good people were accused in of being league witches with the devil. And in league with That's the devil. probably a band name. Oh, shit. Did no one tried to put a stop to the hysteria. Many. In fact, <laughs> most of the people signed petitions. So well, I know what the traditional the cure for hysteria is. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. So Mr. Radcliffe's a dirty dude. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's disgusting. <laughs> Mr. Radcliffe, in the presence of one so distinguished as Aunt Catherine? Really? <laughs> God. Oh, wow. <sighs> Tony, yes, yes. Tony was supposed to close the window behind us, but I'm sure you all can hear the fucking weed whacking that's no. happening outside that is driving me nuts it's like all the time i know it never fucking stops <laughs> i think this every person, time i've been here i know this person spends literally all day every sunday weed whacking i don't know why uh, nobody here has a yard that big <laughs> right you can go out there with scissors and trim it and right okay okay hold up uh, you're flying solo for a second Fiona. oh no shortly after arriving in dear jane went there Jane witnessed witch 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 <laughs> wow <laughs> it's like mean girls 1.0 oh have shit <laughs> only just in time mary bradbury has already been convicted uh, yeah they sentenced, sentenced someone to witchcraft to which uh -huh. you know today i was present at the trials of nine more uh. where will this end I mean, I'm actually a witch. Like, I identify as a witch, which is my spiritualization. Right, right. So, like, yeah. They are now paying people to keep prisoners locked up in their chicken coops and other outbuildings. That's creepy. Yep. No, the whole scenario here is, uh, yeah. He has his granddaughter, Janie True, here with him, who is doing an excellent job of looking after him and trying to keep his spirits up. Mary is 75, and her husband is older. That's uh, quite sketch. So this entire experience has been a terrible Maybe she strain on glasses. both of them. On a brighter <laughs> well, it's all very blurry. Note, uh -huh. The trip here took about a day, and Bethia is a wonderful traveling companion. Her brother Samuel drove oh. the cart. He was there. so adept uh -huh. Apparently she's team, wearing a... We had no is that like... Whatsoever. Is Bethy a friend or a servant? Uh, that's a very. She like, might be a friend of lower class. Oh no. Samuel is charming. Because I mean, that outfit isn't necessarily what I would do for traveling. Yeah, no. Looks like a very. You know, I'm outfit. honestly not sure if we ever saw Jane in the first one, so maybe she looks like that too, and we're just imagining that she wears more more fancy things. I don't know. Like I, well, based on my limited understanding of them, they were considered to be well to do. Uh huh. Yes. Well to do. Well to do. <gasps> it's a creepy. Oh, okay. Oh no. Uh, Something's going to happen. Okay. It shut itself. That's mm -hmm. not creepy at all. Oh, rock. Uh, let's go. Let's go investigate it. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't know that we were playing. Yep. It's it's playing time. Bang. Click click it again. Click. Click it, click it again. Oh my gosh. <gasps> it's, it's the ghost! I'm not sure what I just saw, but it is. Well, I'm pretty sure I just saw that. All right. Uh-huh. Well, we're going to do this. It was, it was a very that makes me <laughs> poorly <laughs> modeled Ken doll. I'm not sure. The window was banging and the curtains were fluttering, and yet, looking out the window, I didn't see any sign of a storm at all. So what did cause the window to slam shut? Yeah. I don't, what I don't did? Know. Ooh, rustling. Well, we I think we made the rustling. Oh, okay. We can we, yeah, we can totally look around the room now okay. if we want to. Well, there's like this card. Mhm. Mm nope. But see, you you can only look at things when the the magnifying glass is outlined in the thinnest red outline you can oh, I possibly see it. Okay. imagine. Okay. So none of this is interactable. Nope. Well, the fire's still going. That's good. Okay. 
we can kill kill the ghost with fire. Everybody knows that ghosts hate fire. <gasps> Ooh, oh, let's interact yeah. with these things. Okay, so we have this book. Mm -hmm. Oh, this window's barred too. Okay. Yeah, and I could open it. You could. You could go outside, maybe even. Oh, it's not. Nah, okay. It doesn't want you to locked. look at it. Tis, tis locked. Tis locked. Tis locked. And we can't. We cannot, for the life of us, unlock it. Okay. Uh, we could probably could go, go back, back to, to sleep. Yeah. Let's go back to bed. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we shut the window. Yep. La, a typical New England La. day. Dull, gray, <laughs> and overcast. Mm-hmm. La. La. <laughs> yes. Oh, boy. Now we can look down here, but uh -huh. none of this is in our None right. of it is okay. important or good. It's books, towels, boring. Yep. Like a typical overcast day. Can we look out the window? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, the window's unlocked oh, again. Oh, no. What? Okay. Well, that's good to know, I guess, that our window can spontaneously unlock itself. Mm-hmm. Okay. See, some a fun thing about these games is that you well, can I click things. As soon as I get dressed. Oh, we've got to get oh. dressed. <laughs> uh, and then it'll go and show you something that you did not even click on at all. But Where's you clicked here it, um, in, in the chest, probably. Yeah. I'm glad I listened to Beth. Oh, okay. She brought fashions which match the customs of the Puritans here in Salem. Oh, oh I see. We're dressing uh, as a Puritan. Certainly stand out. Oh, the latest styles from England. Uh, green. This one will be very nice for Great. today. Great. We're in green. Oh, wow. We get to choose our outfits. We do. We can wear black. I'm super into that. I'll take green. Yeah, let's do green for now, but I'm very glad that we get to basically choose our outfits. Yeah, that's, maybe we can be accused good. of a witch be later. Yeah, when we when we black. wear all black, yeah. I almost forgot my bonnet. Oh, oh, fuck. Don't forget your bonnet, dude. Jeez, I'm so out of it. I know. I mean, that fucking, like, ghostly encounter. Oh, I guess it's that. Yep. Ready for the day. Okay. Oh. Hey, someone's already knocking? Like, jeez, let a girl get dressed. Mm-hmm. Bethia, you are certainly a there she is. on a cloudy day. Look at her. Thank you so much. Isn't the weather dreary? No, it's great. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. Miss Janie True is downstairs, and I was thinking we should is go down Is everyone named Jane? Mm -hmm. She probably could use someone to talk to. An excellent idea. I'm going to stop by my room for just a moment, and then I will join you. Did you forget your bonnet? You no, wash. she's wearing a bonnet. No, she now. forgot Still. her... Her witchcraft? Yeah. Yeah. All of her witch, you don't want a witch You don't want to forget your witchcraft no, at home. No, no, no. Okay. Dis disappointing indeed. Oh, there she hey, is, Jamie. How are you this morning? As well as can be expected. I didn't sleep much last night. That's Too many rights to the dark father. Mm -hmm. How is your grandfather holding up? <laughs> He is working with several other men to collect petitions on behalf of my grandmother as to her character and position in the community. Mm. This is a very that positive is a very step. Positive step. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm afraid it may not be enough. Others have collected similar petitions and yet were still executed. I understand that they have set the date of execution for four days from now. Mm. With so many people against this, how can it be happening? There are two wicked judges. Two Corwin wicked judges. Stoughton, who are causing all of the problems. Activist judges? The judges oh, shit. <laughs> people, even witches. An when American pastime. who are actually mm -hmm. evil? In fact, the judges are the ones who are taken with madness and now appear to revel in the executions. If there are any contracts with the devil, you will find the judges' names upon them. Hmm. From what little I know and have heard since arriving in the new world, I cannot argue with your conclusion. My family is staying with Mr. Danforth in Boston, and he also shares your opinion. It is the new charter brought back from the England that charter? has permitted the creation of the Court of Oya and Termina, which has called for the execution. Wow, I don't know what any of that stuff Me is. Me neither. This is also strange, as I am certain that executions for being a witch have been outlawed, at least in England. Exactly. Wow, remember when England was progressive? Oh my gosh. She is held in a private jail, which only adds insult to our case, as the jail is a barred room in Judge Corwin's carriage house. Oh boy. Oh, we're just going to go break into Judge Corwin's house, uh, Corwin, and go uh, free her grandmother? Yeah. 
Yeah, Which we should do that thing. George Corwin's? It is the first house on the left as you enter Salem Town. But no Apparently there's only to one road. Uh-huh, so it's just on the left? Yeah. I wasn't exactly thinking about asking <laughs> Yeah, we are. We're judge- we're doing a jailbreak. Do oh, hell yeah. Why not? Oh, hell yeah. Thank Jane does what the, whatever the fuck miracle. she pleases. Sometimes it is difficult to know exactly what is needed, but finding that can make all the difference. Oh, here's Bethia. Hello, Bethia. Hello, Bethia. You have been getting on quite well this morning. I'm so pleased to see that you are holding up so well, Janie. Fairly well. But with everything happening so <laughs> oh, far... Oh, Jesus. I know the eyes are freaking me out. Uh-huh. Yep. The, 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 the staring, Rebecca staring Rebecca forward like here. fucking wax dolls. We're going to find out that really all of these people are just fucking automatons. It's like Westworld, except it's Salem World. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And Jane is really like fucking one of them. Oh, hmm, mm-hmm. mm-hmm. What a good idea. What a good Let idea. Go Let's now. make some candles Plenty because time. witches have never I been associated with, with candles. I mm-hmm. need to wait here for my grandfather to return. Don't give it a thought. We will I guess maybe, I don't know, maybe they just haven't heard of wax witches. I mean, it's a thing. So we can just go in without bothering her in case she is asleep. Uh, okay, that's well, kind of creepy. Who doesn't side. knock? All this left and like, to nah, just walk in, whatever. Yeah, I know her. It's like, fine. she's she's not gonna be in the middle of anything, right? Yeah. Like, friendship candles. If I remember correctly, she keeps the candle making supplies in the box to the right of the fireplace. Okay, perfect. If Here's our second start, puzzle. I will go and look in on Rebecca and see if she needs anything. I, I do, do hope she is better. feeling better. <laughs> Well, fortunately, I do know how to make a candle. Excellent. But this isn't Rebecca's house. This is our house, right? Wait, no, I think this is this is Rebecca's house. Oh. I think we are staying in Rebecca's house. Oh, Creek. okay, There cool. they are. Is that? Yep. Candle recipe. Okay. Take a stout piece. Okay, so fill the pot with water. Hang. Mm-hmm. Put the wood mm-hmm. across the large pot. Place a smaller pot with handles in the... Okay, so we're making a double boiler. Uh-huh. We melt the wax. Uh-huh. Wait, mm-hmm. wax and then bayberry wax. Uh-huh. And then cut the wick to length. Uh-huh. And then dip the end of each wick in the melted wax and stick to a petal. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Good. So, yeah, yeah so we have okay. that now. Now let's cl- collect all of these other things. Okay. So we need all this crap. Yeah. All right, got it. P- perfect. Okay. Okay, now we need pots, too. Oh, you just grabbed a, a stick, I think, maybe? Oh, it was right here, yeah. Oh, nice. That's the stick. Oh, yeah, we need. I forget we need sticks to do this. Okay. So, like, part of part of these games is like, mm-hmm. look at the realistic period gameplay. You've got to make well, candles. To good start. Oh, well, we already have a pot filled with water. Already hot. Oh, excellent. So we need to get a second pot. Well, we have this one. Yeah, let's do it. But, okay. I think you can like. Oh wait! Well, we have to put the there. We have to put the stick over the stick first. Stick over. Okay. No. Nope. There. St- stick it. Stick nope. it real good. Maybe it's not the stick. N- oh. Maybe those two wait. other sticks are the the correct stick. There is a stick. It's beautiful. There we go. Okay. Ah! Now put the other stick. Uh, that stick. No, no, no. The other stick. This stick. That's not right. Yes, that stick. That's not right. That's not, That's not right. right. Okay. Uh, maybe Hold the on. pot now? Place a pot with handles. Supported by handles with a lot of pieces. Wait. And a piece of wood. Okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, okay. So we only need the one piece of wood. Yeah. So we it. just do the pot now. Uh, go away. Go away. Go, 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 go back. Right, right. Oh, no. I don't want more yet. Uh, I don't uh, know. know. Click, click something else. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Pot. pot. Do it. Good. 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 Now the wax. I love the smell of beeswax melting. It smells a bit like warm honey. Now it we does. add a little bit of the other wax. Yep. That should add just the right amount. Just of the right amount. And now we cut the string. Right? That's not right. That's not right. Maybe we've got to go to like a table or some shit. Cut, cut wick, wick to length of two candles plus four inches. Yeah. Dip the end of each wick in melted wax. So we do have to cut them. Mm, yeah. Maybe presumably. We'll take the wick and then cut it? No. Mm-hmm. Nah. 
I think okay. we've got to like p- put the things on a table and squish them together or something. Okay, so where's there's uh, no escape from this? Room. There's there is there is no escape there's from no candle escape. making. Okay. Uh, That's ca- not right. uh, maybe it's just, maybe try dipping dipping them in the in the wax. Maybe they're already cut that's down to size. Right. No, nope. that's not right. Damn it! Damn it, Miss Clue! Your puzzles are so confounding. Oh, there we go. Oh, we just had to put the guide up first. Oh. It looks like the wax is Yeah, there we go. I'll dip the end of the wick, and then it should stick to the pebble. It'll stick to the pebble. Okay, dip it. So we dipped. Pebble it. Pebbles. Hell yeah. All right. Now to cool them. Now, now to now to cool them. Well, you have to keep. Okay. That's not right. That's not right. Uh. Okay, so we dipped. We dipped. Place, Place drinks. Okay, okay make sure you bucket out of water next to the fireplace. Dip wet. Uh, as soon as wax is stopped dripping, dunk candles in water bucket. They repeat ten times. Ooh, all right. Uh, Fuck. Okay, dip, dip, dip it real good. Dip, dip it. Oh, there we Hell go. Yeah. Ready for another dip. Dip it real good. Dunk, splish. Dunk, splish. Dunk, I'm glad splish. she's. I'm glad she's keeping track. Hell yeah. <laughs> Dunk, splish. Donk blue God. Twice more. Twice more. Twice more. Look at it. Twice we're doing more. it. Yay, we have candles. I thought we were gonna do this with like our buddy, but we just like went ahead and now did it all our fucking selves. Now to Why would we cut the pebbles off into the wax? Yeah, though? that's weird. Um, now to place them on the drying stick. Um. Uh, maybe we're done now. Though we have no, to place this, them on the drying stick. Yeah, there we go. Oh, take the stick out first. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. The next batch. Oh, God. Oh, <sighs> okay, okay. No, okay, yeah. Good. So in the last game, Jesus fucking Christ. In the last game, we had to do, like, Jane's homework. Oh, jeez. And, like, her archery practice. Now we need to make the friendship candles. Thank God we didn't have to do all of those. Fiona, yeah. how long okay. have we been recording for? About that time. <gasps> it's about that time. Yeah. Tune in next time for more thrilling candle-making adventures. Friendship candles. Oh, shit. <laughs> Things are about to get real. Super real. Well, thanks for watching. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this video or any of our other ones, hit the subscribe button. We and appreciate it. And so check out our much. Patreon. We have a Patreon. Details are in the end card in the video description. Mm-hmm. Cool. We'll see you guys next time. See you. Bye.